You won't believe how CPUs are made. Why are there not more people talking about how processors are actually made? We're about to expose the wild science behind every chip in your PC. Ready? Let's do this. It all starts with sand. Yep, regular sand is purified into ultra-pure silicon. Foundries melt and refine it into giant silicon ingots. Then they slice those ingots into thin wafers, which become the base for thousands of tiny circuits. Next, photolithography uses light to etch microscopic patterns. Think of it as printing tiny highways for electrical signals. Layers of metals and insulators are added, building up billions of transistors. Layers become logic, memory, and interconnects. After fabrication, wafers are tested to find the chips that pass. Wafers are diced into individual dyes. Each die is inspected and sorted. Then the good dyes are packaged to protect connections and heat sink points. Packaging also adds pins or pads for motherboards. Finally, they're boxed and prepared to ship to manufacturers and distributors worldwide, ready to power your laptop, your phone and more, to massive data centers that power the cloud, all built on those tiny printed highways. And that's how Intel produces the high-end chips you see on shelves and AMD follows the same fab steps to build competitive processors. Both power the heart of your tech. Tiny patterns, huge impact. Want a deep dive? Follow for more tech breakdowns. Done.